doing own voiceovers of music. Yan, come downstairs. They are here. Yan heard her mom shouting from downstairs as today she was going to meet her future husband. Relax, Yan. It's not like I'm seeing him for the first time. He is my childhood friend and we both literally spent our all time together till he left for US two years back and we both know each other way better than anyone else. Then why I am nervous today? Maybe because I'm seeing him for the first time after two years and that too has my arranged husband. Relax, it's just a seeing thing, nothing more. He will not you up. Relax, take long breath and exhale. Yan was calming him herself down. Okay, now let's go. Fighting. Cook, you got more handsome. Oh, I'm proud of my son-in-law. Thanks, auntie. Auntie, call me mom. Jungkook smiled. But mom, we don't know Yan's opinion about marriage. Don't worry, Cook. She never says no to me. But mom, what if she has a boyfriend? Yan's mom laughed out. You think anyone will love that lazy sleepy head? No way. Stop it. You guys are making fun of my daughter. She is beautiful. Yeah, sleeping beauty. Mom. Yan said in loud voice after hearing her mom nagging her, totally forgetting that there is two more person. Oh, my sweetie, you come. Oh, Mo, you look so beautiful, Yan. Thanks, auntie. I wish you were my mom rather than her. Yan jokingly said, well, I'm going to be your mom. You're going to marry my son. The reality hit Yan, and she looked at Jungkook, who was already looking at her with a sweet smile, to which she smiled back. Stop your chit-chatting and take your seat. Let's discuss about the marriage. Yan and Jungkook's mom took their seat while Yan sat opposite to Jungkook. So when should we fix a marriage? Ah, uh, mom, I need to talk to Yan first. Can I? Yan's eyes wide in shock and she looked at Jungkook and her mom as he called her mom. Yeah, sure. Yan, take him upstairs and talk. Yeah, come, mom. Come. Jung Both of them left to upstairs i wish both of them agree with the marriage yeah and then we can make our friendship into a family jungkook's and yan's mom said as they were childhood best friend and wanted to turn their friendship into family relation how are you yeah fine and you good yeah you need to say something jungkook jungkook's heartbeat rise after he heard his name from her mouth after a long time well, Yan, I just want to ask if you are okay with this marriage. A pink tint appeared on Yan's cheeks after hearing her name from his mouth. Um, I'm okay and what about you? I'm okay. That's why I agreed to come over here and see you. Yan nodded her head. So shall we go? They might be waiting for our answer. Yeah, sure. Did you both decide it? Uh, yeah, mom, we are okay with marriage. You okay with marriage? Yeah, auntie. Come on, call me umma. Yan blushed. Okay, umma. Well, what about this Sunday? I'm okay. As earlier, that much good. What about you two? We both are okay. Both Yan and Jungkook said in unison. Yan looked up at Jungkook who was already looking at her lovingly. Don't worry, I will not touch you without your consent until you ask me to. Yan's heartbeat got normal after hearing him but one part of her heart wanted to feel his but she can't say it. Mm, son, why are you waiting? Jungkook hold Yan's waist and lightly pulled her towards him. I'm sorry, I don't have any other option. Yan become happy that he will her, so she closed her eyes, but she opened it when she felt his on her forehead, which made Yan's eyes teary, happy tear that he cares and respect about her and her feelings. You both go home, we will be right behind you, Jungkook's mom said, and then they both bid their goodbye to everyone and left the place. Wait, Yan, I will help you, Jungkook said after he stopped the car and went towards Yan to open her with to help her with the wedding gown. Come, let's go to her room. Yan nodded her head as she was nervous cause this is the first time alone with him after two years and that too has her husband and to add today is there. Yan was deep in thoughts when she felt her feet left the ground and a uh, left her mouth as Jungkook carried her in bridal style. Jungkook, I can walk, put me down. 
नो बेबी इट्स योर प्लेस फ्रॉम नाउ ऑन टिल माई लास्ट ब्रेथ सो वाई नॉट स्टार्ट फ्राम टूडे टू स्टे इन योर प्लेस दैट इज़ माई आम यान ब्लस्ट एट हिज फ्लोटिंग एंड ही एट हर न्यू नेम आई डिडेंट नो दैट यू कैन फ्लट यू वेर अ शाई बॉय बिफोर मूविंग टू यू वेज वेल आई बिकम वन फॉर माई स्वीट वाइफ Jungkook carefully made her stand on her feet. Go and freshen up. I will use another one, and Mom Dad will be here soon. Okay, but my clothes. Oh, that I already arranged in the closet. Thank you, hubby. Jungkook blushed at this sweet name from his wife's mouth. Oh my God, you blushed. I feel honored. Yan teased him, but she doesn't know that she woke up the Jungkook shrimped and her to the wall. Well. I think now you are getting comfortable with me so why not show you his love Jungkook said and captured Yeon's neck with his when he bit her skin leaving a hover there which made Yeon to grip her dress tightly but he pulled back and looked at his first and he lastly that mark go and freshen up Yeon immediately ran to the closet and then to the bathroom to hide her red face cute you are making me more in love with you than i am already with you jungkook whispered to himself and also left to freshen up yan came out of the bathroom in her pajamas and saw jungkook in casual outfit aren't you sleeping cook yan asked in confusion no are you going anywhere not me but us us me too yeah come let's go for a night ride really Yan got excited as she really loved night rides. Come, let's go. Yan excitedly said and went towards the door to go outside, but halted. Baby, no, not from there. Come, we will go from the balcony and also don't make any noise. Yan frowned in confusion and went towards the balcony to see a ladder already placed over there. Cook, are we sneaking out of our own house? Baby, actually, mom and dad are here, and if they will see us, they will not allow us to go, and they will start nagging that it's dangerous and all. So I don't want to spoil my mood and our moment. Yan understood him as her mother also doesn't allow her to go out at night, saying it dangerous. Both of them slowly went down the ladder, and Jungkook took his bike, but he didn't start the engine. Rather, he just rolled his bike by walking. Cook, are we going on bike? Jungkook, yeah, right. Rides are best in bike. Both of them were whispering so as not to wake up their parents. Slowly, they reached a distance from the house where the sound of the bike can't be heard to his parents. Jungkook got on the bike, put his helmet, and then. Come wear this. Jungkook took a helmet and made Yan wear it by himself. Hope on. Yan nodded her head and climbed on the bed and said, "Your hand, huh?" Jungkook just turned a little and took Yan's both hands in his and placed a kiss on the back of her both hands, which made Yan blush. And then he placed it on his waist. Never leave your hand from your and hold me close to your heart. Jungkook said and winked, which made Yan blush more after understanding what he wanted. After a long drive with the cold breeze, a uh, lonely road, no hustle and bustle of the city, full peaceful. They reach a beach where no one was there. Here, yeah, I arranged a date for us. Date, yeah, our first date. Both of them went more towards the beach, where Yan saw a table with bottle and some snacks as they had their dinner. You like it? It's beautiful, Cook. When did you arrange all this? Yesterday, I told my friend to do all this. And look over there. Yan turned her head to see a small bedroom arranged, which was beautiful and indeed romantic. Are we going to spend our night here? Yeah, so romantic it is, and thank you for all this. No need of thank you. I done this for us. You are really a man every girl dream for. Well, I don't want to know about others. I just want to be yours. Yan's eyes got teary. Hey, don't cry. I don't like tears from your eyes. And yeah, I will only like if that tears are due to them. When I will 
with you. Jungkook shamelessly said Yan blushed and hit his chest. Cook stopped flirting. Well, I'm flirting with my wife, so I won't stop. Come, let's sit. Both of them sat on the chair and had their drink while talking. Yan, you know you were my crush from a long time. I mean from childhood. Yan got shocked at his sudden reveal. And also, I was the one who asked mom to approach your mom for marriage. Why didn't you say it to me before? Well, I was about to, but then dad told me to go to USA. You know, na, so I thought you won't be able to have a long distance relationship. Two years in USA felt like two decades for me. I was counting each and every day and then finally when I come back, the first thing I asked my parent was to make me get married to you. Jungkook said and held Yan's hand and kissed her hand over the wedding ring. Cook, you were also my crush from childhood. I took was about to propose you after your graduation, but uncle told that you are going to USA, so I didn't told you about my feelings and thought to tell you after you come back and when you come back, mom told me about the marriage and I accepted it without even thinking. Jungkook was shocked after hearing that his crush also loved him. I love you, John Yan. I love you too, John Jungkook. Yan, can I please? I hold myself all these years from not touching you. Yan blushed. Yes, you can, my hubby. For this part, see my Instagram. The link is in the description. Jungkook shrimped and stood up with Yan, hugging him like cola, and went towards the arranged bedroom and laid her down on the bed like she is a paper doll and above her before saying, Why to show you when I will bring thee to you? Jungkook said and both of their eyes showing nothing but love for each other, thus they had their night after their first small date. The end. Thanks for watching. Bye.